Hey everyone, my name is Vishwas and welcome to the first episode of Coding with AI. In the series, I'm going to show you how I use AI in my daily workflow to streamline my coding process and boost productivity. Today, we are looking at one of Builder.io's internal tools. I can't show you the data, but the UI is not a secret. We have a list of items on the left side. You can perform CRUD operations with this list and also favorite items. We are working on a small UI improvement today, and we will use AI to help us out. Our first task is to display the total number of selected items next to this snippets heading. We want it to look like a badge. In our code, you can see we are dealing with an H4 element. I'm going to ask Claude, our coding assistant. I want a badge against snippets H4. Let's choose the current number of selected snippets. Then I'll paste the entire component code for context. Claude will give us the code we need. It uses the Shadsian batch component. And puts it next to the H4 snippets element. Looking at our UI, we can see the batch working as expected but it shows even when the value is zero. Let's refine this. I'll go back to Claude and ask it to hide the badge when there are no selected items. After copying the new code, we can see it is working how we want. For our second task, we need to add a button that links to a Notion guide about using this tool. We want this new button to sit right next to our existing refresh button. Let's break this down for Claude. Perfect. Now I also need to add a button to the left of the icon refresh button that links to a Notion page I have created. First, include the new icon for the button. And then I'll skip the second suggestion as I will include the link inline and copy the button JSX and put it before the refresh button. Save the file and we have a new button that will take users to our Notion guide once we add the right URL. These are really simple tasks, but what might take 10 minutes normally takes just a minute with AI. Imagine the time you save with a more complex task. The goal is to go from line-by-line -line coding to bigger picture thinking and problem solving. If you want to see more of this, me working on real tasks for real projects at Builder.io, leave a like, comment what you think, and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next Coding with AI video.